Hey you guys, what's going on? My name is Asia and welcome back to the Asia Effect. And it has been a while since I have filmed outside. I'm really starting to remember why. For one, it's just windy and there's birds and there's dogs and I'm sure you can hear a combination of all three right now. But I'm still doing this video out here. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So moving is one of those things, right? Like it's a thing in everybody's lives where um, if you're a certain type of person, you will have moved to so many times in your life. And I've also talked to people who have told me that they have never moved. They have lived in the same house like for their entire life. And that is something like really weird to me. It's like, okay, I can understand that, you know, if you're a kid, you don't have much control over where you live and whatnot and if you are the parent of that kid you probably don't have a reason to move in the first place but as a person who has moved like four to five times in their lives so I can say that it's it's not necessarily good or bad but I do have some reasons why it could be either so how moving affects your social life right so some parents can really think that like the more that you move your child around like the better off they'll be in life because they know people from a lot of different areas therefore they'll be more successful don't ask me how that works but I guess that's just how some people think and on the other half you have the people um, who like really seem to believe that by keeping your kid in one spot they will like develop more and be really familiar with a certain group of people in a certain area and therefore making them I don't I don't even know I truly tried with outside, but it's just way too windy and I cannot. But moving for me, um, I can say that like during like the earlier years when I moved like in elementary school, that didn't matter so much because quite frankly, most of the time you don't remember many people from elementary school anyways, unless like I said, you're one of those people who have just never moved. like four years in this one school district and I got so used to like all the people there and you know um, a as I've talked about multiple times now I did uh, not really recently anymore but I didn't move um, to a whole different school district that's like 45 minutes away and it sucks but by now it's it's like almost May actually by the time I up upload this, it's it's May. <laughs> so it's the end of the school year and I've already done my fair share of complaining about how much I hated moving and I still just hate it. <laughs> but this isn't really all about that. When I first moved, I mean, I was a little bit excited. It was kind of like, all right, this is my chance to like leave back all of the, you know, stupid stuff that I've done and I can finally have like a fresh new start that I needed and for a while that's really what I thought would happen but as I got more and more into this I realized that this sucks <laughs> making friends is hard and moving sucks perhaps I should probably go into more detail that might make a bit more sense so um from like grades one through three I went to the same school okay from grades four to half of fifth grade I went to a different school area and stuff and from the other half of fifth grade all the way until ninth grade I went in the same um, district and now in 10th grade I have moved again and as far as next year goes I have no idea where I'm gonna be it kind of makes me nervous too moving doesn't always have to be the worst thing in your life okay I know that that's funny coming from me, the person who just literally complained about it the whole time. But assuming that you're not like me and you're not a total anti-social blob, <laughs> it might not be that bad for you. It's, it's all a matter of doing the opposite of what I did and going out and actually making friends. Because when you move, that's pretty much the only issue that you're gonna have really is just making friends going out and finding people that can make this process a lot less sucky but all you gotta do is make new friends 
maintain your old friends and take advantage of that new start and that's about it but that is probably all I have to say about this for this video I probably should have picked a better topic but you know whatever okay I'm sorry that I missed last Wednesday and I got some news I got some news okay so hopefully you guys have noticed that um, I do try to like move around a lot in these um, in these I guess kind of rants because this doesn't count as a vlog and I'm trying to you know move around make everything look fresh and interesting so I'm not always behind the desk so I hope that you appreciate that and also more news I am probably gonna start uploading on Sundays as well okay now of course you are gonna be getting your videos pretty much every Wednesday but if it comes to a point where I just want to upload on Sunday you'll get a Sunday upload but yep that's all the news that I have for you guys if you did enjoy this video you can give it a like if your heart ever so desires and you can subscribe if you want but until then I will see you guys next Wednesday with another video goodbye